Hey guys, it's Sim Queen, and this is part 134 of the 100 Baby Challenge. I don't know how many more episodes there are going to be of this challenge because we're almost done. Uh, we had baby number 97 and 98, Indigo and Violet, in the last episode, and now we only have two more babies to have, which is probably just one more pregnancy. Um, so, also I'm going to check on the toddlers here, uh, just because they are almost done with their skills. It looks like red. Is this red? No, it's blue. Blue needs to go potty, so I'm going to get her to do that a couple of times. I've got green working on her thinking skills. She's almost done with that. So, so close. Uh, so we're going to age up some toddlers today. Thank God for that. All right, she got to level three of thinking. Let's go downstairs and use the potty a couple of times. Um, both the babies are perfectly happy because we've got the teens, and they have been extremely helpful. Also, I got um, Tangerine to meet somebody new. Um, his name is Omari, I think, or is it just Omar? Omar Al Habib. We're gonna invite him over because he's probably gonna be our next baby daddy. Um, I'm hoping that the teens are gonna get A's in school tomorrow and then move out. I don't know, it might be a long shot, but that would be ideal for sure. Um, I think we need a birthday cake as well. Uh, where is green? She should be coming down the stairs any minute now. Oh, there she is. Okay. So do we have a birthday cake in the fridge? Because we need to age up these toddlers. Yes, we do. Perfect. I think that's in the wrong position. There we go. Uh, did Omar come over? Because I did invite him. There he is. So that looks right there. Oh, he just walked in like he owned the place. I think he's going to be our final baby daddy if everything goes well. So let's go talk to him for a little bit. Um, I just thought if they we could get a relationship going, then that would be the best way to do this. We're going to try flirting. Okay, why is the her child in the way? Oh my god, now I've got babies crying. Oh, that sound, it just gets to me. It's so annoying. Alright, I guess we'll take care of our own child. I have to get away from that. I just have to go. Okay, so um, the toddlers, uh, oh, so close. One more, I think one more time on the potty and then she should be there. And green just got there. Perfect. So let's age up green. Um, help blow out candles. Green. Oh, I just canceled it. I was trying to cancel the other thing. Um, there we go. And then blue will be ready in just a couple minutes. Perfect. All oh, right. Thank God. Oh my God. You know what I just realized? Hold on a second. I think I'm almost positive that these will be our last toddlers possibly ever. Oh my God. That's hold on a second before she ages up. I need to look into the rules because with the hundred baby challenge, I'm not sure if the challenge ends when, um, your sim gives birth to the last two babies or if they have to age up the official sims 4 100 baby challenge rules okay you know what i'll let them age up in the meantime but i'm i'm almost positive that these are going to be our last toddlers okay add candles to that too she ready yeah now the other one's ready too all right now we will help blow candles for blue and then while she does that i'm going to read the the rules here. Um, challenge rules. Okay, so here are the official challenge rules. Um, it may take me a second to find them, so just enjoy this little birthday party while I look. Um, hmm, it doesn't actually say. The objective, oh, is to give birth to 100 children in his few generations. A challenge ends as soon as the 100th child is born. Oh my god. All right, so that means that these right here were the last toddlers we're ever going to have. Sad, sad, sad. You guys have no idea how happy I am about that. That was it. Those, we are never going to see toddlers again. I, I can't even believe it. Like, I feel like I need to repeat what I just said. We're never going to see toddlers again. That was it. Oh, shit. No. <laughs> I'm sorry. That's not right. That's not right. We have these two little demons. 
<laughs> oh my god. I thought I totally thought that was it for toddlers and it's not. These two, they they're going to do that thing that I hate. They be, they're going to become toddlers. Okay, I'm sorry as it turns out. Um we, that was not it for toddlers. It's a lot it's probably the last toddler birthday that we're going to have, I would say. But yeah, that's uh, that's really, really too bad that <laughs> I just don't even know the difference. Oh, Orange is helping them do their homework. That's good. That's helpful. All right, where did that Omar guy go? Because I invited him over for a specific reason. Oh, here he is. Let's go talk to him. Um, brighten his day. Discuss games. No, don't leave. I want them to flirt first. Okay, let me just check all the teenagers, make sure they've got what they need. It looks like we're all good. Uh, and they all did their extra credit. I know that because I checked already. So their skills are good, and then we just have to get the other two to level two and something. Okay, come play dolls. I feel like that's my go-to, is just playing dolls. All right, now you can come play pirate. I don't know if that's gonna build a skill. I think it builds a motor skill. Okay, how are things going with this guy? This is probably our last baby daddy. Yeah, it would be. I mean, assuming we have twins, which I'm sure we will. Oh, we have a school project here? Maybe someone could do that. Let's get one of the kids to do their school project. And one of the other kids can take care of a baby. I feel like there's just no reason to take care of the babies when we have teenagers who can do it. No, don't worry, don't worry, it's fine. We're, we're working on something here with Omar. Embrace him. Okay, and then do a sexy pose. And can we do a first kiss yet? Not quite. We can kiss hands. First kiss. There it is. We're doing pretty good. Um, confess attraction. I guess it doesn't matter. I'm just going to do a whole bunch of romantic stuff. And then he should be good to come over tomorrow. And hopefully we can get pregnant with our last babies. Ask to be boyfriend? You know what? Why not? We already have one boyfriend, but that's fine. We can have another one. All right, there we go. So he is all good to go. So tomorrow um, we should be able to get pregnant with him. Um, we've got Green out here playing on the pirate ship, working on her motor skill, which we already got to level two. And then how are you doing? Oh, you're also at level two. Oh my god, there's nothing left to do? That's crazy. Um, also, I was thinking about it. We may not have any more... Um, well, we are going to have more toddlers. Obviously, um, Indigo and Violet will age up and become toddlers as much as I don't want them to. That is going to happen, but we probably won't have to work on their skills as much because it's not going to matter. Um, we don't have to worry about aging them up. All we have to worry about is giving birth to two more children. Uh, and also, I have been considering, because I was talking a little bit about how I'm not sure what the next challenge should be that I'm going to do, but I did actually narrow it down. I posted a poll on both Twitter and the community tab on YouTube, so I'm going to be getting some info and feedback on that. But I narrowed it down to, uh, to four options um, based on kind of what you guys want to see me do, and I did look into some challenge rules and... Um, Basically, I researched every challenge you guys sent me. Some of them I found really interesting, but at the same time, I thought maybe it'd be too hard or too similar to something I've already done. So the options are the Disney Princess Challenge, um, the Not So Berry Challenge, which I've already done, but I've, it's been requested for me to do it again, so if I put that on there as well. Um, the Super Sim Challenge and the Rags to Riches Challenge. So yeah, if you guys have any thoughts on which one you want me to do, you can also just uh, comment below let me know or you can check out my twitter or you can vote on the community tab as well um because it's yeah i've got i've got it pretty much everywhere um by the time this video comes up i will probably have already decided so that i can get ready for the next challenge uh and then i was considering using 
one of the babies from this challenge, like the next baby to be born, um, as the founder or the heir, I guess, for our next challenge. So we'll see what happens there. I'm still not sure which challenge I want to do. Why can't we ever just cook anything, you know? Let's put this over here. It's because this kid is in our way. He's making food. What are you doing? You're in my way. Yeah, she can't do anything because you suck. Go resume your chili. See, what did he make? He made food for just himself and nobody else. Classic. Like, this does not surprise me at all. Um, okay, hold on. You made that. Why don't you eat it? There you go. Oh, now we've got a crying baby again. All right, um, let's maybe get... Oh, she was already on it, and I stopped. Yeah, Red can do it. She's good to go. Uh, and then all the kids should come grab some food. My plan is to get them to bed as early as possible so they leave me alone <laughs> for the rest of the day. Um, you can grab some food, too. He's almost done his school project. There we go. He finished his school project, so hopefully that will give him a boost at school. Oh my god, I want these babies to stop crying so badly. They're still unhappy? What do you need? Oh my god. Babies are the worst thing ever. I I mean babies and toddlers, they both they're both difficult, but but twins, they're just they're like on a whole new level. Okay, so once everyone is done, they're pretty much just going to go to bed. I have nothing else for them to do. Um, the babies are, I guess, happy enough. Oh, that kid didn't eat anything? All right, well, too bad. <laughs> I guess that's just too bad. It's 8 o'clock. Uh, I know that's kind of early, but I'm putting them to sleep anyway because I just want them to go to school tomorrow. I want to get this day over with. I'm very excited for tomorrow. Tangerine, I mean, we're going to get her to go to sleep for a little bit, but we know those babies are going to start crying any minute now. Okay, please go to bed. Oh my god, I don't know what she was doing outside. I sometimes hate her. Uh, let's, let's fix this toilet. I'm not going to... Oh, we literally don't even get to sleep anymore. I hate you. Oh, okay. You know what? This may be... I mean... Those weren't the last toddlers that we're going to have, but these are actually the last babies we're going to have, or at least have to deal with and take care of, because the next ones, we're just going to give birth and it's going to be over. We don't have to take care of them. We don't have to do anything. Oh my God. All right. Are we good? Can we go to sleep now? I think we'll just sleep on the couch again, honestly. Uh, I've learned the hard way that with twins, you don't actually get to rest. You have to sleep on the couch and... Uh, take care of babies all day so and what are you doing go to sleep you freak there we go oh look at that one of them is up already oh my god these children are abusing me please go to sleep this is crazy i think they're gonna age up tomorrow though let me just check here oh they're Oh, yeah, now, t today, technically, because it's 1 o'clock in the morning. But, yeah, they are going to age up into toddlers. Um, but, like I said, I'm not going to worry about their skills and aging them up because it really doesn't matter at this point. We're just trying to have, we're just trying to give birth. That's the last thing we need to do. All right, you can go back to sleep if possible. I know it's 3 o'clock in the morning, but oh, lots of you guys are up. Okay, you know what? Fine. If you want to wake up at 3 a.m., that's, that's on you. Another thing I'm probably going to do is um, save their the twins' birthday for the last minute. Because why age them up if I don't really have to? <laughs> if I don't have to work on their skills, I don't have to get started on anything. I'm literally just, I don't know, just going through the days, waiting to have another baby. Or two. Oh my god, the kids just don't ever stop asking annoying questions. <laughs> oh, I hate the children. I really do. <laughs> This has been such an interesting experience. I honestly can't wait for the next challenge. I mean, I, I like, I still like playing this one, but at this point I'm like, okay, I want to get this done. I want to be able to say that I completed it. That's what's important to me right now. 
All right, let's get you to go to the washroom, take a shower. I wanna make sure all the kids are on time for school and they study hard because today is crucial. It's extremely crucial. This could potentially be the second last episode of this challenge. I know that sounds crazy, but it's true. All right, everyone just stop what you're doing because it's time to go to school. Oh my God, some of them are in such horrible moods. Okay, leave. Go to school. Do well. It's 8 o'clock in the morning. Don't waste another moment. Yeah, don't worry about the baby. I'll take care of the baby. As much as I don't want to, I will do it. <laughs> this poor woman. She just wants to have fun. Alright, so they are at school. I'll get them all to study hard. All day long. Study. Study. What are you doing? Where, where are you? You're in bed? No, no, no. No, no, no. I'm going to reset him, teleport him downstairs, and go to school. There we go. Okay, he's good too. Um, study hard. There we go. Oh boy. Okay, all the kids are at school. They're all studying hard. I'm so, so hoping someone's going to come home with an A. Even if it's only one of them, we can still get pregnant, and then the pregnancy will update to twins once another Sim moves out. So all I care about is getting pregnant today. That's it. Who's calling? Well, the kids are in trouble at school. I don't care. <laughs> I really don't mind. Uh, oh my god, the phone just doesn't stop ringing. I guess that's what happens when you send six kids off to school. You're going to get some phone calls. Um, oh no, they want us to go to university. That's not going to happen. Okay, I'm just trying to throw these plates away. There's literally nothing for us to do right now. I don't know what to do. Like, we've ha we have this weird quiet time. We'll invite Omar over, I guess. That's what we could do. Um, let me check on the kids' progress at school. Oh, it's so close. Oh, I'm, s I'm actually really nervous. I kind of feel like the one who has the best chance is Yellow because he did, he did that school project. But I think he's going to get there. I honestly do. I'm scared to watch, but I'm, like, watching the bar go up. Okay, just take care of that child, please. I need to watch you. Oh, yellow got the check mark. Okay, he is going to age up. Let's get the cake out. I know it's early, but I'm so excited for this. There we go. And Omar is here. Um, I'm hoping he doesn't leave. Oh my god, which one is crying now? Stop crying. They're both miserable. Okay, you know what? I might just age them up just to get it over with. Yeah, you know what? They have to age up either way, so let's just let's just age them both up. All right, Indigo is inquisitive. Good for you. Age up the next one. Yeah, I mean the, the toddlers—they're just gonna exist. We're not gonna work on their skills. We're not gonna worry about any of that. Okay, what's going on, honestly? Don't worry about them. Just leave them. Oh my good god. Everyone's in my way. Age up. I'm trying to go as quickly as possible here. Alright, so Violet is going to be uh, fussy. Of course she is. That is just my luck. Alright, now let's get to work on flirting with um, Omar, who is actually her boyfriend, so it should be easier to woohoo that way. And we'll see how many of our kids get to age up today. All right, so yellow for sure. I'm gonna get them to come blow out the candles. And then what about the rest of them? Oh, yes. Okay, that is perfect. That is honestly perfect. Um, they're all gonna age up. This is not a drill. Okay, yellow, come on, let's do this. All the teens are gonna age up, I'm so happy. Okay, so I don't care what your trade is. It doesn't matter to me. Add birthday candles to that cake and we'll get the next one going. Come on, put the candles on. What are you waiting for? Thank you. <laughs> I'm getting so impatient. I'm so excited about finishing this challenge. Um, and now we need to move him out. Goodbye. All right, next. Come on, Red, you're next. She looks so grumpy and miserable. She might die. 
Because we know what happens when I move them out with MC Command Center and they're in an extreme mood. Sometimes they don't make it. Okay, add candles to this cake. Let's go. Yeah, I know. You got to check yourself out. You are feeling yourself. I get it. All right, so we're going to move her out too. I just heard a really bad noise. I think someone peed themselves, but it's fine. It's honestly fine. Um, all right, let's go. Can we woohoo with this guy now? Can we try for baby? Try for baby with Omar. And then you are going to go blow out these candles. What an exciting day. No, don't talk. Make a baby. It's different. Oh, what, this what is going on? It, the, the option's not even there anymore. Hold on. What is this? New baby. What? Okay, I'm very confused. <laughs> I'm very confused. Just try for a baby. Like, it's not that difficult. You've done it many times. All right, add candles to that, and then you get to move out too. Thank God for that, honestly. Um, okay, say goodbye to Orange. He's getting out of here. Um, move into a new household. There we go. All right, are you guys getting this done or what? Get out. <laughs> this child needs to get out now. Oh, they got in anyway. Okay, I see how it works. Um, so the kids, maybe they should all do their homework. I mean, like I said, it honestly doesn't matter that much because either way, like it doesn't matter if the kids age up, it doesn't matter what they do. All that matters is that we give birth to at least two more kids. That's, that's, the, that's the end of the line for us. Okay, instead of using MC Command Center, because I kind of don't know, I don't want to know what we're having. So I'm going to get her to take a pregnancy test just to see if she is pregnant. Usually I just check with MC Command Center, but for the last one, we're going to do it this way. Have it be a surprise. There's so many notifications. Okay, so she is pregnant. Oh my god. I'm sure of it. I am so sure of it that it's our last pregnancy. I mean, I really doubt it's just going to be just one baby, but there is a chance that it could be. Let's go serve some dinner. We're going to make pasta primavera. Um, they're doing their homework. The other kids are perfectly happy, actually. Things are going pretty well. All right, so I would say that the next episode, we're going to have the babies, and that's going to be it. I mean, I'm assuming that we're having two or three. Uh, she, The most she can be pregnant with is, is three. Um, and I'm, I'm sure it's going to be multiple. So, assuming this is our last pregnancy... This will be the second last episode of the 100 Baby Challenge. The next one, we're going to wrap it up. And that means it will have been, what episode is this? 134? 135 episodes for the 100 Baby Challenge. I know some people have done them in a lot more parts than that. But um, the difference with me is that I play incredibly fast. And I know that. Um, I play really quickly. But we didn't cheat. We seriously didn't cheat. Uh, I think that I cheated their needs a couple of times, but like I didn't cheat pregnancies. I didn't cheat um, skills. I didn't age kids up early. I honestly played following the rules, and that was my, my biggest goal, I think. Uh, let's get you to take a shower. And how are the toddlers doing? They're, they're fine, I think. I guess we can get them to grab some food before bed. And then Tangerine, let's go say goodbye to Omar. He doesn't have to be here anymore. He's just eating our food at this point. Uh, send home. Uh, I'm going to put Tangerine to bed because she has had a rough day. And then the kids can go to sleep too. Oh, somebody wrecked the dollhouse. Who would do that? Who would commit such a heinous crime? Uh, I think that this one should go to sleep. Yeah, and then I've got the toddlers eating, but honestly, they're mostly in good mood, so it'll be fine. I don't think they can get all the way up the stairs, so I'll probably have to teleport them. Just, just stop eating. There we go. Teleport here. Teleport here. There we go. Okay, they can both go to sleep. Um, they kind of have to use the potty, but it's fine. We should be okay. Uh, these two in bed? No, we're missing one of them. Oh, she's coming. There we go. I'll keep an eye on Tangerine because her last pregnancy, 
I mean, we know how that went. She peed herself probably five or six times. So I want to keep an eye on her this time and make sure it doesn't happen again. Why is it not going at ultra speed? Did Omar not go home? I thought that he did. I don't see him. What is going on? It should be at ultra speed, but it's not. Okay, well, I guess we're just gonna have to play through the night slowly. It might be a glitch with, um, I, like I moved those three sims out using MC Command Center. There's someone at the door too, it's Zucchini, go home. Like one o'clock in the morning is not an appropriate time to knock on someone's door. It just isn't. Okay, did he, is, is he gone? Please be gone. There we go. Now we can go at ultra speed. Um, so yeah, keep an eye on that bladder. It's, it's, <laughs> it ain't what it used to be. That's for sure. She's actually doing pretty good. Um, usually it's later in the pregnancy where they just, it, everything just goes to hell. <laughs> and your sim honestly can't even function. Um, you can go back to sleep. It's only 3.30. I know I put them to bed early, so that's just what happens. It'll be nice not to worry about their, um their needs and their skills and their homework like it do, we don't even have to worry about it honestly we can just do what we want all right I know it's super early but I'm just gonna get them up and ready for their day the toddlers are actually in really good moods that is I couldn't ask for better honestly that is really good then tangerine can come grab some leftovers the rest of this challenge is gonna be pretty simple um it's just gonna be pretty basic and like I said, I'm, I haven't decided which challenge I'm doing next, so I don't exactly know what I should name the next babies, or at least the last baby, because like I said, I'm hoping that sim will carry on the, um, the legacy. Uh, so I don't know. I don't know. They, I'm, I'm hoping they'll be my founder sim for the next challenge, but I don't know what to name them. I can always change their name as well. Let's clean up these plates. The kids should be off to school. I hear something broken. What's broken? The sink? Yeah, it's a sink. It's always the sink. Let's go clean this up. And I think that's pretty much all we need to do. Um, the kids should be leaving for school now. Perfect. Uh, the toddlers are actually pretty happy. Like, I don't know what I need to be doing with them today because they're already in good moods. Um, we could potty train them, I guess. I don't even really want to, but we have nothing else going on in our lives. Uh, and then which one are you? I guess I'll teleport this one downstairs. There we go. And then she can just watch the potty training, which I, I feel like I learned that trick a little too late in this challenge, but it is what it is. Watch Indigo. And then we're gonna potty train Violet. Okay, so Indigo acquired the potty training skill. I don't know why I'm even bothering with this. They don't need skills. <laughs> they just need to exist. Grab a serving and grab a serving. At this point, it's, it's nice because all we have to do is keep the babies alive, uh, the children alive. And I think I can handle that. I, I mean, I've done a pretty good job so far with the last 98 children. I think I've done an okay job. Um, I think I'll get her to, I don't know, go... What is there to do around here? We could go swim laps. Oh no, it's kind of cold for that. I don't even know. We don't own a TV. Go play some video games. That'll do. And then these kids are eating so I can put this away. Um, we're pretty solid right now. We are pretty solid. I, I mean, I don't know what to do with them. I could work on their skills, but like I could use a break from that, honestly. What's going on? There's an invisible person making a salad right now. What's happening? Like a cutting board just showed up and then this random bowl just showed up. Someone's invisibly making a salad. Okay. Oh, we gotta go pay our bills. Okay, that is a good point. Oh, we can do it on the computer, can't we? Um, they give you less time now to pay your bills, it seems. Like we only got, got the, uh, the bill yesterday and they're already like threatening us. Let's go grab some leftovers. All right, uh, maybe you can come play dolls. Oh no, you can't, this is broken. <laughs> oh my God. It, I, I know that it doesn't really matter, but I feel so weird about just doing nothing and just spending my time 
waiting for these babies to be born. Okay, come come fix this. Also, how should I end the next episode? Like, I don't even know. Should I go over the names of all 100 babies? Or do you guys not want to spend time listening to that? Like, because I don't know. I, I kind of want to do something, though, to commemorate all the Sims that were in this episode, or in this series. Because there was a lot. Um, 100 babies, 3 baby mamas, um, countless baby daddies. I don't even know how many. Probably close to 80 because we had so many multiples. But, I mean, yeah, we had a lot of characters. A lot of deaths. <laughs> so, I don't know. Maybe for the last part, I'll just go over all their names or something like that. I don't know. Maybe show some highlights. I don't know. I, I have to try to make it special somehow. But for now, I'm going to leave this episode right here. I will see you guys in the next part for the last episode of the 100 Baby Challenge. Thanks for watching.